How y'all doing? You man, this is a neighborhood culture country edition. Ooh. Got that ghost pepper whopper, boy. What you talking about? Got my Coca Cola there. And uh, a little whiskey, boy. Y'all know it's Halloween time. Damn. Eww. You know what? And I'm a moonshine this year. That's right. All right, y'all. Just trying out, going through those uh, the costumes. I'm trying to figure out what am I trying to be this year. I was gonna be a, I was gonna be a moonshiner. That's what I was thinking about. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, y'all. It's not put that. Man, I think it's broken. It normally don't do that. It's not a BB gun. I'm getting ready for it, y'all. What y'all think? Ah, oh, look. Freeze. Hey, don't. Cut it out. Get away from my steel. Get away from my steel, boy. Alright, I'm done. I'm done, y'all. I'm done, okay? You think I should go with this costume or what? I, I was Joe Dirt one year, and so I have this left over. I have this. Huh? What do you guys think? Not too bad? Maybe I'll try something else. Let me know in the comment section. What should I be this year for Halloween, man? About to drop this video this week, okay? And we got the got that ghost pepper whopper burger. The only reason why I'm eating this thing is because it's the Halloween burger. Shout out to the Halloween spirit, man. Let's see what we got here. Ooh, it's got a spooky orange bun, son. You ain't seen nothing like that. Oof. Look at that. Got a full orange bun. Dang, with the black sesame seeds. We got bacon, fried jalapenos, got the spicy queso, habanero cheese. Whew. Man, this thing's looking crazy. We're gonna have to we're gonna see what time it is, y'all. What do you guys think? Shut I don't put the ranch right here. I like a little ranch on my fries. Let's see how, how spicy this burger is, man. Let's see. I'm gonna tap in. That Burger King Ghost Pepper Whopper. Shout out to Halloween. This thing's spooky, dude. Cheesy. Get the spicy queso. Crunchy jalapenos. Bacon. Got that nice, you know, charbroiled patty. Sesame bun is good. Kind of sweet. It's got some heat to it. Not super spicy. And the fries. Bomb. I always love fries. I was looking into like the origin of French fries. Man, I saw a bunch of different folklore. Like in the 1600s in Belgium, they were making some. They used to fry fish a lot, so I guess they were making French fries then. Some story there, and in the 1700s, the French fry was in France, and there's like 17 something. There were uh, there's a recipe for French fries and blah blah, you know. America's over here writing this dumb independence. French fries are being made in France at the same time. Come on, man, step your game up, America. 
You could have been inventing the french fry. Come on. Come on, y'all. And from there, man, french fries, they're all over the world. Everybody eats them. You know, you got the french fry, palm frites. You got the papitas fritas. You got the batatas fritas. You know, all over the world. Portuguese, Spanish, French. Everyone eating those fries, boy. And they're fire. Where are your favorite fries? Me, I never met a fry I don't like. But I really do like In-N-Out fries. All right, y'all. It's burger. How do I feel? Well, man, I don't know. If it wasn't for Halloween, I don't know if I would want this burger. It's bomb. I like it. Or maybe it's a burger you want once in a while. It's got all the, it's got the habanero cheese, got the cheese sauce, super cheesy. Jalapenos and everything. I mean, it's tasty, man. It's bomb. It is bomb. In terms of heat, it's not very hot. For some people, they might think it's hot, but I said it's like a five. I like a five. See, this one's got a lot of cheese sauce in the area. Let's see. Look how spicy it is. Burger's pretty good. I like the jalapenos. Honestly, all when that, if you put fried jalapenos on a burger. It's hard not to like it. Then you have bacon and cheese and all that stuff. I mean, hard not to like. From brother to best uncle. Best uncle, son. What y'all know about that? Alright y'all, are you going to try this burger? Are you going to go out there and head it up? What's your favorite thing at Burger King? Honestly, I don't go to Burger King too often. But once in a while, it's a bomb burger, man. I like it. You know, you get the little char grill taste. I, I enjoy it. When I was a, a youngster, man, I used to grow up. Or when I, I used to grow up. I did stop growing a while ago. But <laughs> besides that, what's it called? I, I, we used to... Uh, do certain activities. Uh, rhymes with Mary. Rhymes with Juana. And we used to do a lot of that in high school. Or a bit of that, towards the end especially. And, you know, you don't got a lot of money. You know, what are you going to do? You're going to hit a Burger King. You're going to get that rodeo burger. You're going to get that spicy chicken. Okay? You're going to go get those dogs. What's up, Gypsy? What's up, mama? Come here. What's up, take your boot? What's up, take your boot? This is what's up, you got a crazy dough. Who's your move? Who's your move? Alright. Sorry. Y'all just saw me get... I like my dogs, man. Gotta love my dogs. Gotta take care of your dogs. Anyways, and we would walk like two miles to get these burgers whenever, middle of the night. Go get that dollar rodeo burger. It's a burger with onion rings, barbecue sauce, and I think a little cheese. Can't beat it. I grew up on a lot of dollar dollar menu stuff, man. Especially, man, when I was growing up, uh, you know, I grew up around a good, solid group of friends. But, uh, excuse me, I used to paint a lot of graffiti. You know, which, if you paint graffiti as an adult, you know, stick to your passions, do you. But for me, it's like a, it was kind of a growing thing to, to, to move from that graffiti lifestyle. But yeah, man, we'd be out all the time, all these weird hours. You end up eating the dollar menu because that's what op what's open, man. 
and we didn't have a lot of money. Go to McDonald's. Jack in the box. Two tacos. What's up, Gypsy? What's up, Mama? Jack in the box. Breakfast Jacks. Junior bacon cheeseburgers. We'll be smashing that. Then we go get McDoubles. Get the McChicken. Stick the McChicken in the McDouble. That was the lifestyle back then, man. That and uh, some 40 ounces. Maybe Old English. Maybe Mickey's. We'd be out till. Man. Actually. All night. We'd be coming back about 4 in the morning. 5 a.m. Running around paying graffiti all night. Whew. Man, I'll have to tell y'all some stories. All types of situations. We got a lot of stuff. Went through went through a handful of things, man. But a lot of crazy, cool stories for you guys. Ate a lot of great food in that time being. Saw a lot of amazing art. You know, met a lot of artists. You know, saw the different neighborhoods. and the, the good, the bad, and the ugly. That's what life's about, man. Remember, every neighborhood's got a culture behind it. It's always, you know, go explore that. <sighs> Alright, y'all. Tell me, uh, what, what do y'all know about graffiti? Anybody of y'all grow up doing some stupid stuff? You out there painting? You know, who knows what? Running the streets? Let me know a crazy story, something y'all got into. It's okay to share these things as long as you're moving on, man. As long as you keep growing, you know. And that's what it's all about. Because, you know, with me, every day I focus on being positive, going to the gym, focusing on my mental health. And that's what it's all about. Focus on my money, business. That's what you got to do, boy. But it's okay to reminisce once in a while. As long as you're not glorifying everything, you know. You don't want to do that. Whew. All right, y'all. This burger. If you like spicy, go try it. If you like cheesy, go try it. I know you queso people out there. If you like that queso, try it, man. Woo. Spilling that water. God dang. Hey, man, don't be scared to go eat spicy food. You know, sometimes people are like, oh, man, you know, this is too spicy, this, that, and the other. Just eat it. Eat it. You could build your spice tolerance. If you think it tastes good, just eat it. Go through the pain, man. If, if, as long as it's not the end of the world, it will not kill you. And be remember, try new things. Be out there trying new stuff. You know, I try a lot of different food. You know, but I'm gonna go. You know, tap in on you know little things like this. Why not? Halloween burger. I'm pretty sure everybody's pretty nostalgic. You know, to Halloween. All right, y'all. What should I dress up as? Leave it in the comment section. What, sh what food should I go tap in on? What should I try? I need to know, you know? I'm, I'm roaming through these streets, man. Eating the streets. Trying to figure it out, y'all. Uh, this was a fun one today. <laughs> Hopefully it wasn't a... What you looking at, man? My dog is just staring at my burger. She is... What is going on here? But you guys know what time it is, man. It's neighborhood culture. Today was neighborhood country. This is this was Moonshine Merb. If y'all don't know, that's what some of my homies call me. Call me Merb. I'll have to explain that another time. But until next time, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Go eat the streets. Peace.